Texas Governor Gretchen Whitmer met with Patrick Leoya's family today to offer her condolences. News Ace Jacqueline Francis talked with the family about that visit and joins us in studio now with what they had to say. Jacqueline. The governor was in Grand Rapids this morning to privately meet with Patrick Leoya's mother and father. While she wasn't able to comment on the ongoing investigation, the family says they immediately connected over the love a parent has for their child. Two weeks after losing their son at the hands of police, Governor Gretchen Whitmer paid a visit to the grieving parents. Really saw that she was a mother, she was a parent. She was more welcome, she was open. Speaking through an interpreter, Peter and Dorcas Leoya said the meeting was emotional and the connection genuine. She showed us concern that she was really touched in a negative way about what happened and she's mourning with us the same way that we are mourning. She was in pain. We saw tears coming from our, tea, our eyes. She cried the way that we are crying. 26-year-old Patrick Leoya was shot and killed by a Grand Rapids police officer during a traffic stop. His parents asked the governor about police reform. We told her that they need to review the police and they have to do a police reform and to bring new teaching new things to teach the police so to prevent people's life to not add a parent to don't go through what we are going through. Whitmer remained neutral due to the ongoing investigation. Leoya will be laid to rest this weekend with civil rights activist Reverend Al Sharpton to give the eulogy at Friday's service. I want to say that God bless him and bless everybody that is around us who are helping us and supporting us. The funeral will be held Friday at 11 at Renaissance Church of God in Christ in Grand Rapids. The service is open to the public.